A stretch reflex is initiated by the stretching of a skeletal muscle and results in its reflex contraction. A knee jerk reflex is an example of a stretch reflex that can be artificially initiated by tapping the patellar tendon. The reflex begins when sensory receptors known as muscle spindles are activated. Muscle spindles are located in skeletal muscle, in this case, the extensor muscles of the knee, and are activated in response to slight stretching of the muscle, such as occurs when a tendon is tapped with a tendon hammer. This fires an action potential along a somatic sensory neuron, which travels via the dorsal root of a spinal nerve into the spinal cord. Here, the sensory neuron synapses ipsilaterally with a motor neuron in the anterior gray horn of the spinal cord. This triggers an action potential to be propagated via the ventral root of a spinal nerve to presynaptic axon terminals of neuromuscular junctions in the stretched skeletal muscle fibers. This leads to muscular contraction, relieving the stretching of the muscle. The sensory neuron also synapses with an inhibitory interneuron, which in turn synapses ipsilaterally with a motor neuron that controls antagonistic muscles, in this case, the flexors of the knee. This leads to relaxation of these muscles, which causes the simultaneous contraction of the stretched muscles. The relaxation of one muscle resulting in the contraction of its antagonist is known as reciprocal innervation.